I am back with another video and today I'm going to show you my Ulta Polish haul. So I told you guys about this haul a week or so ago before I went on vacation and I told you that I got all 10 of these polishes for right at $20 and it was like $20 and like 50 cents or something and I have 10 polishes here and I did get them online so that's including the shipping that I paid. So Basically, what you do is you go to Ulta.com, which I will link down below, and all the time they have coupons on their website. And if you sign up with them, then they'll email you coupons and sales and all kinds of stuff, too. So I'm signed up with them, so I had gotten an email telling me that they have their $3.50 coupon, which is three $3.50 off of any purchase of $10 or more. So I had one of them, which you can use in-store or online. And when I went on the website to check it out, they had a bunch of things on sale, including China Glaze, buy one, get one free, and Revlon's buy two, get one free. And a couple different China Glazes were actually on sale to begin with. So I'm going to run through all the polishes that I got for you guys and tell you how much they cost me and show you the swatches of them. So I'm going to start out with the China Glaze here. So let me go ahead and push all the Revlon's out of the way. So like I said, the China Glaze were buy one, get one free. And I did swatch them just so you guys could see what they look like. And all the polishes from the Electric Knights collection and all the polishes from the Road Trip collection were actually 50% off already. They were only $3.50. Plus, they were buy one, get one free. Plus, I had the $3.50 off a $10 or more purchase, which is freaking killer deal. If you guys buy China Glaze from Ulta, you know that they are $7, I believe, or $7.99. I think it's $7.99 in store, but on the website, it's $6.99, I believe, for one China Glaze polish. So to get one for $3.50 is a killer deal in itself. To get two of them for $3.50 is freaking amazing. So I have the China Glaze Electro Knights collection. I had all the polishes except for the glitters, but I was missing two of the creams. And the two creams I was missing was UV Meant to Be, which is this beautiful blue right here. And it's just a regular light blue cream polish. And this is it right here. And this is two coats without a white base under it. And then I also got Ready to Rave. And this is the other one that I was missing. And I wouldn't consider it red, but it's like a it's like a corally shade of red, like an orangey red. It's absolutely beautiful. This is it right here. This is also two coats without a white base coat. Not I did not put a base coat on any of these polishes, and I did not put a top coat because I wanted you guys to be able to see um, what their finish was. And then the two that I got from the outdoors collection, or the um, I apologize, this is the road trip collection. This one is called License and Registration please license and registration please and it's like a like a blue jean color it's like a blue jean blue it's absolutely beautiful and these all have a glossy finish as you can see this is two coats beautiful they were all opaque in two coats two regular coats not not especially thick and this one's called my way or the highway and this is also from the road trip collection there it is right there so all four of these polishes together were $7 before my coupon. All four of them. $3.50 for one. Buy one, get one free. So I got these two for $3.50. I got these two for $3.50. Killer deal. So now I'm going to move on to the Revlon. And these were buy two, get one free. And these were anywhere from $2.49 to $4.99 a piece. And they had about 20 or so to, to choose from. So I made sure that I only picked the ones that were $2.49 a piece. So essentially I got these three for $5 and these, well, these three for $4.98 and these three for $4.98. So I'm going to run through these really quick. The first one right here is called... Wait, that's not it. Ha, 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 ha. Just kidding. This one is called Wild. It's number 565. And it's a gorgeous green color. As you can hear, this is, as you can see here, this is two coats to get opaque. And you could probably do three on this one, but I just did two. And it's a beautiful green, and it's got... It's got a shimmer in it, and it's got, like, a hint of pink in the shimmer. It's really pretty. And then it's got like little silver um, silver and green flecks in it. It's absolutely gorgeous. I don't know how well it's coming across on camera, but it's beautiful in real life. 
This one is, I think, probably one of my favorites for sure. It's called Smoldering, number 370. And it's absolutely gorgeous, 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 gorgeous. It's like a, um, like a, a gray color. And it's got pink and blue shimmers. And it's got little flecks in it of, let's see here. Looks like just silver flecks, but it's got blue and pink shimmer with it as well. And it's just absolutely gorgeous. I adore this color. I think it's just so, this is one of those ugly pretties. You know what I mean? And it's just beautiful. It's ugly, but it's pretty at the same time. And I love it. So this next color right here is called Gold Coin, which is somewhere around here. Here it is. This one is Gold Coin, number 925. And it's beautiful. I wouldn't consider it actually gold. It's more of like a champagne-y color, but it's beautiful. This just took one coat to get opaque, as you can see. And I even wrote on the back of these two. So you can see, you can't even see the writing through it. And this is just one coat, you guys one thin coat at that. It wasn't even a thick coat. It's absolutely beautiful. It is not necessarily textured, but it's not smooth at all. These two dried with a glossy finish, and this one, I guess you'd call it maybe like a demi-matte, because it's not glossy, but it's not really matte either, but it's beautiful. And this next color right here is called Copper Penny, number 932. And just like the gold, it is one coat to be fully opaque, as you can see. Absolutely beautiful. And it's the same thing. It's kind of got like a so sort of a demi-matte kind of finish. And there's a piece of my cat's hair stuck to the purple. <laughs> Sorry about that. And it's beautiful. It's got the, just like the gold, it's got, you know, like thinner and chunkier sort of in it. I don't know. It's kind of hard to explain. It's got, it's a beautiful color and then it's got like the shimmer in it and it's got like flex as well. It's beautiful. And this next color is definitely another one of my favorites. And this one is 929. It's called Diamond Texture. Look how absolutely gorgeous that is, you guys. Gorgeous, gorgeous. And I actually used this in the Bootyful Nails Challenge um, for the Striped Manny. I, this is the color that I used to put the dots around the Jack Lantern's face. And look how absolutely gorgeous that is. It's beautiful. And this definitely is a textured polish for sure. It is silver, and it's got silver shimmers in it, and it's got little tiny silver. I can't tell if they're hexes or if they're just like uh, regular confetti, but they look like little tiny hexes to me, but I may be wrong. They might just be little circles, but look how gorgeous that is. I freaking love it. It's so beautiful. It did take two coats to get opaque, but it's absolutely beautiful. And then this last color here is number 240 and it's called Impulsive. And I apologize, it took a little chunk out of it up here at the top. You can still see it. This is two coats to be fully opaque. And it is a darker plum shade of purple, just a regular cream. And it has a glossy finish. Beautiful. So I know I don't usually do um, polish hauls and polish swatches and stuff like that for you guys. But because I got such a killer deal, I wanted to share it with you guys and show you everything that I got and tell you how you could do it too. So make sure you check out Alta.com. Like I said, I will leave it down below. And make sure you sign up for their little thingy thingy so that way you guys get all the coupons and stuff too, okay? And you don't have to use it online. You can do it in the store too. But a lot of times um, it'll be the polishes themselves will be cheaper online, but you do have to pay shipping. So you might want to shop around, go to the store, and check out online and figure out which way would be cheaper for you. And if you have the $3.50 off coupon, and let's say it's good for seven days, you can use that same coupon every day for seven days. Or go to multiple Ultas every day for seven days. Or do like I do, and take your husband with you, and send him the same coupon, and then you guys can do two purchases at once. So, make sure you check that out. I will have it linked down below. If you have any questions or comments, feel free to leave them down below for me in the comments section. And I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, please give me a thumbs up, comment down below, subscribe, and come back to see me next time. Bye now.